Alright, so in this video, this is kind of like a tutorial for physical animation, which is like half the ragdoll or simulating physics on the character model, but also half his animation playing. So you get some cool things like rubbing up against walls or like just the body of the character colliding and simulating physics with the surroundings, which is pretty cool. So, yeah. Alright, so the first thing you want to do is click here on the left and on the mannequin, double click on character, then double click on mesh, double click on the physics mannequin. Down here in profiles, if you don't already have this, click on windows up in the top left, then down to profiles, tick profiles, and it will come up somewhere on your screen. So, click in physical animation profiles, click new, Chain, call it whatever you want, but I'm going to leave it as it is. Then click in the skeleton tree and hold down control A to select all the bones and assign the physical animation profile. Okay, so now I'll save this and close it. Now in the third person blueprint, you want to add a component type down physical animation then click on mesh and scroll down to collision change the collision presence to custom and keep visibility as ignore and set camera to ignore then keep world static and world dynamic as block and all below that set to ignore Set collision enable to physics only and object type to world static. Then click on capsule component and set the capsule radius to a small number, so 10. Yeah, set the capsule radius to 10. And then compile and save. So in the event graph, right click and type event begin play. Out of here, you want to set skeletal mesh component under physical animation, drag out mesh, and drag that into in skeletal mesh component. Out of here, you want to apply phys physical animation settings below. Set the target as physical animation and drag out from bone name and promote to variable. Name this bone and compile so you can change the default value. Change this to pelvis or whatever the bone is called. So in skeletal mesh underneath root. Yeah, mine is pelvis but yours might be something different, so I'd check that. And it has to be completely correct, like capital letters and everything. So our physical animation data, make physical animation data, turn is local simulation off, and set orientation strength to 1000, angular to 100, strength to 1000, and velocity strength to 100. Turn include self off and out of here set all bodies set all bodies below simulate physics. Drag in bone name to the bone variable and change new simulate to tick and untick include self and compile and save this and that should be done so you can close this and press play yeah so now the character can brush up against walls and and collide with the world all right that's the video so like if it worked and subscribe to the channel to see more i guess so cool yeah See you in the next video, yeah.